Pre and postnuptial agreements are agreements between a couple whereby they record how their assets will be divided in the event of a divorce or a dissolution. So the key difference between prenuptial agreements and postnuptial agreements is in effect timing. Prenuptial agreements are entered into prior to the marriage or civil partnership and postnuptial agreements are entered into after the marriage or civil partnership takes place. So although nuptial agreements are not legally binding, as a result of case law, they're given significant weight by the court if they're freely entered into. Both parties have a full understanding of the implications of the agreement, having provided full financial disclosure to one another, and the agreement is fair. It is also recommended that you enter into the prenuptial agreement at least 28 days prior to the marriage taking place. There are many circumstances in which a nuptial agreement may be beneficial to you. You may be getting married for the second time and wish to safeguard your children's inheritance. You may be the beneficiary of a trust or have received inheritance which you wish to keep separate to the matrimonial assets. You may have a change of your circumstances such as receipt of a gift which you wish to safeguard. You may have a company which you wish to protect, particularly if there are other shareholders, or you may just want to have a level of certainty and avoid protracted proceedings um, in the event of a divorce or dissolution. At Family Law Partners, we establish at the outset what is important to you. We provide you with tailored advice as to the most cost-effective way to achieve your goals. We adopt a non-adversarial approach to the discussions with your partner whilst ensuring that your interests are still met. We recognise that nuptial agreements are often sensitive topics to broach with your partner. However, if drafted fairly, they really can provide peace of mind and certainty for both parties.